some medical checks. Um, and then they finish up their meal and the doors are opening up. This is the first shot of our inspiration <laughs> for crew members walking out of Hangar X. This is amazing. There they are, our first all civilian crew walking out of Hangar X. They look so excited. <laughs> Right now, they're walking down this pathway, waving hi to family and friends, some SpaceX employees in the crowd as well. Yes, uh, this must be such an exciting and emotional time for them. Um, and the crew that you see there on your left-hand side, that was Chris Simbroski. He is the mission specialist. To his right is Dr. Cyan Proctor, the pilot for this mission. Uh, and to her, uh, to the right of that is uh, Jared Isaacman, the mission commander. And uh, Jared is blocking Haley, but she's in the background there. <laughs> there that is, is the uh, medical officer, uh, Haley Arsenault. <laughs> what a sight to see. They look so yes. excited. And this is just the beginning of the day for them. They're getting ready to get into the Teslas. You can see one of them there. Uh, where they will ride to the Falcon Support Building, which is where the SpaceX suit-up room is. And currently they're at Hangar X. Uh, you may be wondering what Hangar X is. This is our brand new facility at SpaceX, designed and built by SpaceX to house our refurbished vehicles. Uh, so some of them are hopping into the car. Um, in the first car, we have uh, Dr. Cyan Proctor with uh, Haley, and following them will be uh, Jared and Chris. You can see the gold wing doors of the Model X is closing there. And they should be, again, making their way to the Falcon Support Building. It's a couple miles down the road. They're gonna be making a left out of here, heading north on Kennedy Parkway at uh, Kennedy Space Center in Florida. And they will take this one last moment as they're in their Teslas to say goodbye to their close family and friends. What a sight to see. They must be so excited. They're yes, in their Teslas, yes. about to make their way to the suit-up room. One last uh, goodbye to their family and friends. Yeah, they do have a long day ahead of them. You can see the um, countdown timer on the bottom of your screen. We are still four hours and some change away from liftoff. Um, there is a lot of procedures that will happen over the next couple of hours, and we'll be here to walk you through all of that, and we'll be able to get some awesome views of the crew going through those procedures as well. And they are currently sitting in their Teslas. Uh, these are not just any Teslas. These are the Teslas that we have used if you followed our crew missions. These are specially designed Teslas made uh, to accommodate our SpaceX spacesuits. So they will utilize these even after they make it to the Falcon Support Building to drive to the launch pad. There they are pulling off from Hangar X, now on their way to the Falcon Support Building to our new SpaceX suit-up room. Yes, there is a third Tesla there um, that is support staff members of the closeout crew um, to support the astronauts in any way possible. So again, in the first car, we have uh, Haley and Dr. Cyan Proctor. And in the second car, we have Chris and Jared. <laughs> this is the first time that we get to see inside of the Teslas. This is so exciting. Oh, this is amazing. This is such an amazing view. It almost feels like we get to ride with them yes. in the car. <laughs> Chris, Chris looking very cool with his sunglasses. <laughs> I love it. While we watch the crew make their way to the suit-up room, let's take a moment to get more acquainted with our first all-civilian crew. Jared Isaacman is